What's going on guys? This is Chris from Chris and Shoe with a new video on how to get service and MMS working on your iPhone with Straight Talk. This will work for the iPhone 3G, 3GS, iPhone 4. Now the iPhone 4S was giving us problems with the MMS. Everything else worked. We finally got MMS working but we had to do, um, jailbreak it a couple of times to get it to work. Alright, cool thing now is that Straight Talk is now selling SIM cards. You no, don't no longer have to uh, let's see here, spend close to $150 for a phone. You can just spend now $15 for a SIM card and they will send you a micro SIM if you need it and just pay for your $45 a month. Uh, subscription I guess if you want to call it that all right let's get started first off uh, my iPhone is jailbroken uh, the reason why I have it jailbroken is to get MMS if you only want to use the service and only use data go ahead and use well I'm sorry if you want to get data just go ahead and use that unlock it website service you don't need to be unlocked or jailbroken jailbreak is only for MMS okay people well and data I guess Alrighty, let's get started. We'll, we'll hop into Cydia. Yeah. Now, Exalize uh, re, um, source has been. Oh, I am moving a lot, I'm sorry. Has not been working, so I found another source that worked. Uh, in my opinion, much better, much faster. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and get that. Oh, wow, I am really on one tonight. Well, I got all of this. Sources. We will go ahead and get that source right there. Repo.hackyouriphone.org. Uh, that's the only source you'll need. Everything else is just stuff I, you know, got wanted. You know, blah blah blah. blah. This one not really working as well as before. But hey, that one's working. That's the one I'm actually using on my phone right now. All right. Once you get that source, go ahead and. Um, you are gonna search for the Tether Me APN editing. Just type in the T E T, and you'll find uh, that one right there. Tether Me APN editing. Once you get that one downloaded, boom, you'll get these as well. Get the one with a little drill and a little blue emblem. All right. Once you get that done, whoop, whoop let's go. Now let's get it all set up you will go to your general network sell your data all right APN go ahead and put in att.mvno visual voicemail uh, I just put that in there uh, MMS go ahead and put att.mvno MMSC put in that mmsc.singular.com uh, MMS proxy, go ahead and put proxy.mvno.trackphone.com. Uh, those two little dots and the number 80. For the max uh, message size, that one was already in there, that number. I just left it alone. I didn't really do anything to it, and it works. Alrighty, now let's. I guess we could do a little test, I guess. On. Jeez, my network. Wi-Fi off, I guess. All right, now we're in the 3G. I see if you notice, um, it's a straight talk on top. Uh, yeah, I, I'm the one that put that in there. When you put your SIM card in there, it should say home. But you know, giving credit where credit is due. All right, you can put anything else you want. I mean, it's up to you. I use some. Uh, real quick, shout out, I guess, to the program I used. I used Fake Carrier. And I put in straight talk. All right. Now let's go ahead and go to our website. I was on the Apple website. Uh, let's go to another. What's a good website? Uh, Elon's World. I, just, I love that website. It's funny as heck. Oops. I cannot spell today. Okay. Well, that's a couple now. It's 
Loading, loading. This thing, this page has a lot of things going on, so I'll take a watch load, but there you go. Ready to go. You can see the 3G data oh, no. emblem up there. It's working. Alright. Now, the cool thing about that source and that thing you got working. Turn the 3G on because I'm going to need that. I mean, the Wi Fi. Okay, it's going to have the Wi Fi symbol right now, but it's going to go away. Alright, okay. Your personal hotspot. I'm going to go ahead and get a quick demo of that. I thought it was pretty cool. Turn it on. Wi-Fi needs to be enabled because you're going to be using it. See, once I turn it on, it's going to go to 3G. Now, I have a device here which we could... Oh, oh weird. I wish I could show you. Alright, I'm using my iPad. And it's showing a, you know, Wi-Fi. Alright. Let's go to settings and let's go ahead and look for my... Before the iPhone. All right, and there it is, iPhone 4. And as you can see, it has like a little chain thing going on. I've used it before. See, now it's going to tell me uh, one connection. And up here, you're going to have that thing right there. Boom, yeah, all right. So what can I do to show you guys that it's working? I guess the test I guess that should be pretty cool enough right all right let's get that showing I mean rich in speeds actually over like 350 3.5 let's see here Okay, I guess beats really vary. Alright, let me go to results. Okay, as you can see the times here, I did it tonight. Well, just tonight. And those are the speeds I've been getting. Alright. But as you can see, it works. Let me go ahead and shift this off. Bam. And this should go back to Wi Fi. Wi Fi. There it is. And Cox in Omaha gives me. Mm, not bad. Alright, well there's your video. If you have any questions, rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, hit me up. If you have any questions, I'll go ahead and as soon as I get the chance, I'll hit you guys back up, right? Alright, peace.